This is a short video to help determine whether a toilet is a low flush toilet that uses 1.6 gallons or less per flush or a full flush toilet that can use 3.5 gallons or more per flush. It's a good thing to know the difference between the two when purchasing a replacement fill valve. If the wrong fill valve is installed into a toilet, performance could suffer or gallons per flush could increase. Because there are many makes and models of toilets, this is the guideline. The date the toilet was manufactured can be helpful. In 1992, the Energy Policy Act was passed. In January 1st, 1994, it made 1.6 gallon per flush a mandatory maximum for new toilets installed in the United States residential buildings. If you live in Massachusetts, in 1988, low flush toilets were mandatory. Look for a date on the toilet. The underside of the lid of my 1952 Kohler has a date stamped on it. Look at the size of the tank. The 1952 Kohler tank is 21 by 14 by 8 inches. The tank is a big square box. It's not tapered. Check behind the seat for the manufacturer's name. Check on the inside of the tank for a model number. With a manufacturer's name and model number, if it's a modern toilet, you can probably track down the specs on the toilet. Inside of this Toto, 1.6 gallons per flush is stamped on the back of the tank. I hope you found this video helpful on determining whether you have a low flush or full flush toilet. A thumbs up is always appreciated and thanks for watching.